with the family of Alex Muteti, 21-year-old Shuja of Kenya, who unfortunately was shot dead by the police uh, last Tuesday uh, during the peaceful protests that were witnessed in Kibwezi. Uh, according to the doctor, Dr. Midigo, who performed the autopsy, uh, she said that uh, Alex uh, died due to hemorrhage, that is excessive bleeding, uh, due to one shot that went through the back. He was shot from the back and it exited from the front of the abdomen. And that one shot, he pursued vessels and that is what led to the hemorrhage or over bleeding until he lost his life. This is yet another young Kenyan only 21 years who has lost his life uh, due to the excessive force that uh, we continue to witness uh, that police are applying to protesters who are merely exercising their constitutional rights and Kenyans will know very well despite guarantees made by President Ruto in one of his uh, speeches that police who use excessive force will be brought to account to date not even one officer not even one officer has been brought to book and we are asking why is the state encouraging impunity and people like the father here are continuing to suffer with no help coming from the government and we are saying as the president said enough is enough at Sisi to nasema enough is enough with the police killings in this country you can't keep killing our youth every other day and nothing is being done to bring justice to those families he was looking forward uyo kijana alikuwa asaidie familia huyu ni baba yake they had so much hopes the boy was supposed to join college but a bullet from the back from the back meaning he was no harm to that police officer who shot him the bullet went through the back naikatoka mbele can the police can this new ig kanja explain to kenyans why his officers are shooting young kenyans from the back munaua munaendelea tu as if you know it doesn't matter these lives to the police are just nothing we're saying enough is enough and we must get justice now we have to get justice. Thank you.